We are in the Rocho Kitchen this morning. Thanks to our friends at GoProvidence.com. We've got Red's Kitchen. Max Reeves is here. We've got some deep-fried uh, bolognese, uh, deep-fried gnocchi with some bolognese this morning. Great That's to correct. Have you here. Yeah, yeah, thank you very much for now, having me. We were just saying, last time you were here, just so people know, you do have a, a food truck, but you also have a physical um, restaurant itself, yep, which is in, not, right down the road from here. That's right. We just moved into a place in Seekonk over behind uh, Fantasyland. It used to actually be the Sherwood okay, uh, wedding yes, venue. Yes, so yes. we now have a 4,000 square foot ballroom. Oh, that's and, great. And, uh, yeah, excellent. And, and, the, and the food truck as well. And the food truck and is out of there, truck. too. Yep. Mm -hmm. All good. Mm -hmm. All good. So tell us about what we're going to make and what we need to uh, to put this all together today. So this is just uh, some hand-rolled gnocchi that we made. It's potato-based, mm -hmm. so it's essentially three potatoes, egg yolk, uh, flour, a little bit of salt, and uh, you kind of make like the, the perfect baked potato. Yep. And then what you do is is you, you mix all the rest of the ingredients in, you roll them out, and then chop them and up. And then chop these them up. Guys. Now these don't yep. take very long either at, um, to even cook, correct? No, that's a really, in a typical, we're going to deep fry them, but um, in a typical, uh, you know, uh, boiling, you know, method, you would, it just floats right to the right top. Right to the top about when it's ready to go. 30 seconds, right. 20 seconds. And yep. nothing like a good bolognese. Yeah, and that's our, yeah, this is our bolognese meat sauce. It's actually uh, pork, veal, lamb, and chicken livers in there. Okay. Um, and uh, it's basically made with a little bit of mirepoix. Yep. You sear the meat really, really hard, and then um, we add in our mirepoix, reduce it down with some red wine, and then we're going to bring it together with some cream, some butter, a little bit of grana padana cheese right there at the end. Grana and, padana uh, and, cheese. And fresh, <laughs> yeah, fresh basil. All right. So it, it. it sounds really, really good. So we will uh, we'll put this together. Also, talk about the restaurant in case people are looking for places to have parties or events that, that are happening there, too. We'll tell yeah. everybody about that, All too. Right. Okay. Excellent. We'll do that in just a little bit. Back to you. The Roadshow Kitchen, thanks to GoProvidence.com. Max Reeves is here. Red's Kitchen is the location. And we've got some uh, fried gnocchi bolognese on the menu. So there is a location, which is right in Seekong, not too far from us. There's also a food truck that you have as well. So two different places. Yep. Um, the place down the road here in Seekong, you have uh, an event spa space too, right? Yeah, we have a big wedding venue. Uh, it's 4,000 square feet. Fits up to about uh, 2, 225. Um, and then we have a private room, another 50. So all, That's great. all said and done, we can fit about 300 in the upstairs venue so it was it's a great location for us we're Absolutely. really excited yeah we're taking you know looking at what we take with the food truck and you know doing more of our you know advanced catering kind of right. stuff right. so, so yeah, many people are looking, looking for at. places to have uh, different events and, oh, and yeah. kind of gatherings and get right. people back together so that's, right. a, that's yeah. a perfect place yeah. to perfect There's, place to it's, do it it's definitely come on in the last you know like six months, I'd say yeah. before <laughs> that it was a little dicey. It's like, oh my God, where are we going to go? <laughs> yeah. So tell us what we have here. Uh, so right now, this is the uh, the that, uh, bolognese uh, meat base that we made. Yep. Um, and what's great about this is you can make this in in big bulk and then just freeze it. Um, and then um, basically what we do is we're just gonna bring it back to life with a little bit of chicken stock. Got it. And then at this point, we're heating it up. Get that going for a little bit. Yep. And then the uh, the gnocchi that you that you made too is pretty easy to do. Yeah, the hand, this. I mean, you can buy this at the store. They do sell, you know, right. other gnocchi, and you can boil it or you can deep fry it. But again, this this recipe that we do is just three potatoes, one egg yolk, a little bit of olive oil, salt, and pepper. And that's it. Come and on. you got to you you bake the potatoes till they're like a perfect baked potato, like you said. And then you you put them through a little ricer, the little rice oh, thing. Oh, okay. Keep mushing them down. And then you just mix it in with the flour, egg yolk, and the flour is just one handful per potato. One handful of flour, and that's it. Oh, that's it. And then it? you just roll them together. Oh, yep. Oh, okay. And pop out, and they're like little pillowy, like yeah, little yeah, guys. Yeah, nice. You know? Yeah, they're good. And okay. Then, um, so this is getting nice and hot. Stir that. At up. this point, yeah, just the fish. I mean, this is like I said, if you make this ahead of time, I mean, it's really, really an easy, easy pickup. Yeah, I mean, you can just defrost a little bit the night before, come in. And just a little bit of heavy cream, a little bit of butter. Kind of thicken that up. Yep. You want me to stir this? And stir then, this um, while you do that. Yeah. Okay. Don't you stir that up? Stir and then bolognese loves basil, so we're just gonna add. You know, I add some into the base. We add some, and then another little bit right, right at the end. Right. Um, to kind of brighten it up a little bit. That looks really good. So we're just gonna. And it smells fantastic. So we'll just take some of this. And just shift it on. Cut that. Throw that right in. Put that in. And I'm gonna toss these into the fryer. And those probably don't even have to go very long either. No, this is like, literally, it's going to be really, really quick. I just put this over here so it doesn't splash up right. at your home. It's nice having a fry later at, at work, yeah, so it's, it? it's much easier. Is it, is it but, 350? You know, is I would say it's about 350. 350 yes, when, yep. you, when you're making the, yep. when you get the oil hot. Okay. So we'll get this going. Mm -hmm. Now, while we're, while we're doing this, Max, just tell us um, 
uh, what about the other foods that you have? So you know, yeah, I mean we do uh, the, with the, the restaurant truck. we got we inherited a really nice pizza oven, so we're doing some really great oh. hand tossed pizzas. Great. Um, and then we've got uh, we just got onto Uber Eats and um, Grubhub, and we've actually got. It looks like you're ordering from our site, but it's a DoorDash delivery mm -hmm. now. Right. So they do that. And, um, Turn this down a little bit. You know, so you can go in, just get pizzas from us. We do, you know, we do all the same stuff we do off the truck, too. We do cheesesteaks and fries and, right. and, you know, uh, wings now, bar food, that kind of stuff. But, um, you know, really getting into the banquets, the... You know, appetizers, hors d'oeuvres, wedding food, showers, where, where that kind of stuff. So you, now we have our have. deep fried gnocchi like this. Yep. Just going to hit it with a little bit of salt. And mix those in. And that is it. And then we just need a plate. Oh, we got a plate. I can, I can <laughs> get you. You need a plate? All right, I'm going to yeah, yeah. keep mixing that. I'm going to grab you a plate. So this is all set. This is, comes together pretty good. Hang on. So not too, not too thick. And then... Uh, Excuse our parents. And that's they, it. Is that good? Yep. That works? So okay. that's perfect. perfect. So we can either do... You know, you could just pour the gnocchi in and pour it on top, or we just put a little bit in the bottom. Right. Well, and while he's doing like that, if this. you would like the recipe for this, you can head on over to our website, and that is going to be roadshow.com. Thanks for coming right. in. We'll show, yeah. the, Thank show you. the uh, finished product in just a little bit.